editing attribute. In the previous video, we were able to add new field. So this video, we will edit those attributes. So if you right click and go to open attribute as usual, this our population, we cannot be able to edit it. So how do we edit? To edit this attribute, you turn on your editor and you select that very uh, attribute you want to select because the, if you check they are not in the same database so you see when i check on the lgaa it's only it that has the rest are on different so it means they are on different your databases okay so you okay and then you right click and open attribute table so once you come here you want to double click You'll be able to type so uh, it be local government let's assume it be has a population of one million people okay one hundred thousand karim local government let's say they have a population of seven hundred thousand seven hundred thousand Okari local government, let's say they have a population of 1 million. Donga, 200,000. Takum, 150,000. Belly local government, 300,000. Gasol, 400,000. Kurme, 80,000. Sardona, 100,000. Dashaka, 350,000. Adokola, one twenty thousand Zing three hundred thousand Jalingo one one million five hundred thousand Euro two hundred thousand Lao. 250,000 so it's just an assumed population and this is not the relocation so once you're done with this you will come and it is save edit and then you stop editing so if you come back to attribute table now you will see that this have been edited so even if it is to edit you start the editor and then you check this again even if it's to edit already existing um attribute like for example if you realize that this name is not eb you can change it now the headquarter if it's not eb you can change it so you can basically change everything the only thing you can change here is this uh, shape length and shape area so you can change the geopolitical zone let's say this is not in taraba south not and all you can all change this so this is what i have for you today for more video visit our video archives